now we can get this damn review. What's up guys going on? Camp out uh, coming at you with another review. I don't even know, is this number three this week? This is, this is a treat, it's definitely a treat going on. So 30th anniversary on the top of the box here. I don't like that this yellow light is hitting this, so give me a second. So we'll come back here. Um, light has been adjusted. Again, apologies for the dye all over my fingers. You're actually in where the magic happens, right here on this bad boy. Anyway, back to the box. Uh, I do like the um, the box, I guess, from this year. Uh, some of the special project and the 30th anniversary stuff comes in this box. I like it. Uh, Sakura Sakura. Uh, this is the uh, uh, Kobe Beef. Uh, Gel Light 3, size 10.5. It is my size. I'm staying true to size on all of these because they are the OG silhouette. Um, if you didn't catch any of the Ronnie reviews, um, then I would say, yes, this is the OG silhouette. The original, not, you know, sometimes you say OG and you think like 2011. No, this is the 1990 silhouette of the shoe. Oh my God, what is going on with this light? Super bright, man. Take it easy. See if that'll tone it down a little bit tone. Uh -huh. Anyway, let me take them out of the box and we'll get into it. Uh, what do we got here? Uh, the Jedi 3 was born from hard work, constant experimentation, and a bit of rule breaking. I sought to challenge the idea of what a running shoe was at the time. So this is uh, whatever. It's on all the boxes. I don't even know why I started reading that. Anyway, let me get into this. <laughs> uh, the lighting is a little dark. I do apologize, but I'm going to bring this a little closer for maybe like 10 or 12 seconds and give you a little wrap around. Considered a prized Japanese delicacy, the Wagyu cattle meat is known for its marbled texture, flavor, and tenderness. While most of the properties are difficult or impossible to faithfully recreate in sneaker form, they're manifested in the Gel Light 3's colorway and quality. I don't even know where I was at on this. Son of a bitch. Uh, probably like a break in here somewhere at some point. I don't even know what the hell is going on. Uh, we'll just take it from the pink. So we got pink all over the entire top of the shoe. No extra laces. So you got pink flats in here. They look like wax flats. So they have a little wax consistency to them. A little bit stiffer than your typical lace that comes or flat that comes in a Gel Light 3. Uh, very premium across this entire shoe. If you guys saw the uh, Super Gold review, you saw me playing around with this toe box and how soft it was. Uh, you get to see me do it again. Very, very premium, very, very soft, good bounce. Nothing uh, too delicate about the shoe, but it's made very well. Um, I would say the Super Gold is probably a touch softer, probably because it wasn't dyed. Uh, it was just white and it kept white, or maybe it was bleached, who knows. But either way, like I like the feel of this and the, um, the OG silhouette of all of the 30th anniversary stuff. You can see it's a little bit wider. Uh, TTS is what I stuck with on this, 10 and a half, like I saw, I showed you guys in the box. Pink leather across the entire shoe. The only hit that's a little different is the debossing in a couple of hits and the embroidery across the uh, Asics Tiger striping. Very, very clean. I like the effect of it. It kind of gives you that like marbleized meat kind of look. So Kobe beef, if you get what I'm saying. Uh, and then you got the embroidery across the 1990 in the heel windows there. Debossed for the Asics across here. I'm pretty sure this is Gel Light 3. Uh, I would almost bet money on it that this says Gel Light 3 right here and this other debossing just because there's three numbers or three eyes at the end uh, is my assumption on that. I could be wrong. If I am, I will look it up before I do the um, rest of the editing for the video. So I'll, I'll definitely let you know. Also, the other cool thing is the outsoles. The outsoles are translucent. I uh, love this effect. Doesn't last that long on any of the shoes that I have had with the... Um, that, that translucent outsole, love the way it looks, but you know, it, it is gonna yellow and it's not gonna last that long. Um, it has a Gel Light 3 model inside here. Uh, I can't see all of the detailing on it, but it's a Gel Light 3 model. Looks like it's somewhat picked apart and uh, spoken about, probably like the back of the box or the inside of the box. So very, very clean. And uh, we talked about the laces, footbeds or white leather. Uh, inside is the only other color variation, which is a white leather as well. I told you TTS, which is the 10 and a half. OG silhouette, which is the original silhouette. Night the 19, this is the 1990 silhouette. So this isn't the 2011, 2013 era of the Gel Light 3 or anything after that bananaed up. This is 1990. That's what they're talking about when they're talking about original silhouette. So just a heads up on that. And uh, it fits pretty full. So again, TTS on the sizing. I did a little video outside earlier today, but it got super late now. So there's no like super on foot. It's just a couple of looks uh, standing on a step. But if you guys have any questions or comments, hit me in the comment section. I am out of here. Peace.